It's simply incredible that our little hamlet of Putings has once again smashed all expectations by raising a staggering £33,351 at Poofest 14, our great little music festival that is rapidly becoming something of a phenomenon. Thank you to all those who helped and supported us, and to all those who brought tickets and came along to enjoy the day, as without you none of this would have been possible. The money raised last year was split 50-50 between St James's Place Foundation and New Futures Nepal. And what has been particularly refreshing about working to help both charities is the way in which they have rolled up their sleeves, mucked in and helped us to organise the event. The level of commitment there has been inspiring. Both charities support disabled and disadvantaged children. St James's Place Foundation by providing grants to organisations and other charities who are running projects within communities all over the world. The money raised through Poofest 14 helped St James's Place Foundation to make grants to Castle Haven Community Association, who run a youth centre for disabled and disadvantaged children. The Ear Foundation, who help deaf children and young adults. And AfriKids, who are running a foster programme for Ghana's most vulnerable children. New Futures Nepal, on the other hand, are a small charity that started off almost 11 years ago, rescuing disabled and orphaned children who were living rough on the streets of Kathmandu, providing them with a safe home, an education and a future. They currently look after 29 children in Kathmandu in a home which they have built there. And this year, they've been able to complete a second home in the town of Kalimbong. The children in Kathmandu have been living well below the water poverty threshold and they've had to make do with a broken drainage system which has become a potentially lethal health hazard. Through Poofest 14, we've been able to fund the installation of a sustainable water supply and to fix the drains, work which is due to be completed shortly. What a privilege to be able to help all these children. And having visited Kalimpong and Kathmandu myself, I know just how much your generosity has changed these children's lives. I came to this Hanmi house when I was eight years old. Now I'm 16. I have a great journey in Hanmi house. Uh, before coming to Hanmi house, I was not able, I was not educated as my mom and dad was dead. And I used to uh, stay in neighbor's house. And then after coming uh, in Harming House, uh, I feel like I, uh, I'm in home, I'm in my family, with my family. And thank you for giving me such a mom and dad, which is like dearest to me. Uh, and thank you for New uh, new, new Future uh, Nepal, for supporting me, for guiding me, for giving <coughs> every facility you have provided me. Thank you very much. My name is Abhishek Shota and I'm from I'm from a small village from Sikkim and when I was eight years old I came home in house and now, today I'm 15 years old and I'm in standard class 10 <clears throat> and I'm very happy to get new family with his brother, sister and uh, especially mommy and papa who care for us and loves us as their own children <clears throat> and we are very grateful towards them. This year, we're determined to raise even more money to help St. James's Place Foundation and New Futures Nepal. So please support Poofest 15 on the 22nd of August by telling your friends and coming along. Tickets and information are available on our website, poofest.co.uk, and please follow us on Facebook and Twitter. We have some great music and surprises lined up for you this year, and it will be a fantastic day. We look forward to seeing you there.